What's going on guys and welcome back to some more Ghost Recon Breakpoint. So, today is the uh, first episode of episode 3, which is the new set of missions that we've got in this new DLC. I'm very excited for it, I'm not going to lie. I do enjoy this game, but I have missed it because obviously I've kind of gone through all the content that this game has to offer already. And uh, yeah, I'll bring it back though if you want to see more of this. Anyway, I've got the new, one of the new masks on. It's really, really nice. I will be doing episodes of more free roaming stuff where we check out the weapons and whatnot, and we can also check out some of the cool outfits. But I thought I'd showcase one of the new masks today, and I think we we'll, should be unlocking rewards as we go through these missions, and we should unlock more customization options and whatnot. But anyway, we go on like that. Hopefully, you guys go on to enjoy this episode. I will be playing this in the hardest difficulty. I'm probably going to regret it. But it's fine. Pretty much all the heads-up display is pretty much off. I just prefer it that way. I think it's more immersive. Hopefully you guys don't mind too much. You think we'd end up here? It just makes things a bit more interesting. Anyway, as always, let's go speak to the radio like a crazy person. Nomad, Scott Mitchell here. Sir, could you hear your voice? I've seen the reports of your activity on Aroa. Good work. Conspiracy is degraded. But FSB has told us that Stone has aligned himself with a group of Russian ultra-nationalists. They have a stockpile of chemical weapons. We believe they intend to use the drone technology to conduct a coordinated terrorist attack against the U.S. Millions of American lives could be at stake. You're going to have to dismantle this new organization by eliminating their top leadership. Stone is the highest priority. I'm sending you an updated target deck with the HVTs. Comes all the way from the top, my friend. But with Congress and all eyes on us, we can't send support. Copy all, sir. I won't let you down. We're counting on you, Nomad. Good luck. Damn. I don't know how you feel about that, but I actually quite like that. Ever see yourself doing Mission completed? Sorry for shouting, but what the devil? Seriously? That's a mission to you guys? <laughs> Okay. Or, oh, sick. I think what they're doing is going down the old Wildlands route. Okay, you remember in Ghost Recon Wildlands where uh, there was like a, a person to kill in each region? You had to go to each region, complete a few missions, and then you found out where the person to kill was, or capture, or kidnap, or whatever it was. And uh, then you had to deal with them then. I guess that's similar to what we go, what's going on here. So we've got Harpy. He's got some rewards for us, including masks. Oh my days, this is going to be really sick. This, I'm, um, I'm excited. I'm not going to lie to you. So that's got, look at that. Look at that mask that you get for that. Uh, it doesn't show what the reward is for that. It doesn't show what the reward is for that. It doesn't show, oh no, it does. Why is it showing some of them, but not all of them? I don't know. Sphinx. He's got a, a bit of an outfit going. This is nice stuff, man. Okay, I'm excited. Well, I guess we just get started. Um, I can't, I'm going to go for stuff because I want certain things. I really want that mask. So I'm going to go after this dude. Get briefed by Colonel Mitchell at night. Reach. Let me re read that, please. Reach the sunken clipper bay bivouac. It's in a smuggler. Okay, I can do that. At night. Sunken clipper bay bivouac. Alright. Guys, if you want to enjoy this episode, you want to see more Ghost Recon Breakpoint from me, then let me know by hitting the like button. Subscribe if you are new and you don't want to miss future videos. And, uh, yeah. Let's just get on with it. Alright, we're at the bivouac now. Obviously, we need to wait for it to be night time, so we may as well do this. I'm just pretty sure I've just made it early in the morning, so definitely not waiting around for that. But can we just take it a second and appreciate how nice that mask was? I'm about to change it up once I've unlocked whatever this one is, but still. Also, yes, I will be playing with the squad, and yes, I will quickly change their outfits so they're all matching me. I like that. As for what weapons they've got, we've got Vasily with the Tac-50, Fury with the AK-12, and... Fix it with the 416 shorty. They have all got suppressors on, but I don't think that actually helps. Look at us, man. <laughs> Feeling good about this. All right. Ghost actual. Nomad, over. Send it. Ready to track down Manticore, sir. Okay. Target Manticore is Stepan Belovich, a Bodark specializing in drone tech. He's supervising the production line. They've already produced the drones capable of carrying nerve gas. Now, the shipment's last known whereabouts were the harbor. Those drones absolutely have to be destroyed. Deliveries only happen during hours of darkness, so you'll have a little cover. Stand by for a map with a potential infill point. 
but disregard if you got a better idea. Oh, sweet. Roger that. Nomad out. Okay, so made a made a big point of giving us the option of how we want to do it, but they will give us a suggested entry point. Oh wait, you want us to base jump for a mission? You realize that's one of the hardest things to do in this game, right? <laughs> Absolute clowns. I kind of wish I had a sniper right now. If you guys remember, one of my most popular videos on this game was sniping from up here, very early on. What's the objective? Gather intel about the container's location. We just need to find the documents within this place. Okay. We could probably go about it relatively stealthy then. As long as... Ugh, it actually worked. As long as I can land here without being spotted, that is. I may actually try... I'm going to try and land all the way at the far end. Or maybe on this white roof here. Okay, I'm going to go for the roof. Uh-oh. Oh, that was too close. Oh, shit. Sniper. That was way too close. Man's down. Standing. Oh. I want to just take out whoever it was that was going to spot me. It's just him. I think we're okay. No activity here. We need another sniper. Can't see too far out there. No, it's not enough. Just stop already. Get out of my hair, please. All right. No, don't. This is one of the intels. I didn't actually realize it was in this building. Oh no, the chair's in the way. The chair. Thank you. <laughs> oh. Damn it. Are you kidding me? Son of a Fire! Fire! Really? Did you just stop with this shit, okay? Eyes on a sniper, about to shoot! Shoot me, bitch! Cover! A sniper's gonna shoot! HPG, uh, shoot attack. me again! No man, you need to check those boots fast! Thanks, chaps. Okay, so obviously we've got the first one already. I know, I know. I messed up. Okay, but it won't happen again. I promise. I'm going to be a lot more careful here. And I'm going to try and maybe take out any snipers. Ooh, I don't know what the bullet travel is like on this thing. Hold up. Let's see how accurate it is there. That's actually pretty decent. He's out. But I'm not risking that again. Not perfect headshots or anything like that. Um, I think the best bet might actually be to, to crawl around this road. And just enter in through that way. I can't really think of anything better, but I also don't know if I can even... Yep, I can. Maybe as tactical as I can here. Pull the shoot. Really should have picked a better gun than this. It's not the most powerful of all the weapon episodes I've done. How did I not remember that this thing's not powerful? Maybe it's been nerfed since, I don't know. And be as cautious as possible. The other one's right on that far side, but obviously we know there's a lot of snipers around and we know there's a lot of people that are willing to kill me the second I start trying to get intel. I don't actually want to kill too many people that are on the ground if I don't have to. Ideally, I won't kill any of the people on the ground. Don't say a word, bro. Located a bad guy over there. Yep, I see him. I'm Splinter Cell in this, even though it's not the Splinter Cell DLC. <laughs> Lead. No need to shout. We're being stealthy, you idiot. He had to die. He can die, I think, because he's on that mound. A bit more protection. Alright, I'm going for it. There should be a sniper up here somewhere like that. 
I do like the enemies when they just come out with a load of nonsense sometimes. Hey, you see that? Yeah, me neither. It's night time. <laughs> Good one, pal. I would turn off the generator, but that's going to panic everybody, and I'm not about that. Oh, wow. Three people on alert. This, this, this is, I think this is the truck we want. Oh, the container maybe? Or is it is is this intel inside the building past these? I got a feeling we're not alone. I could try and take them all out, I reckon I could, but Okay. I don't know if I need to. I think I might need to. I don't think there's ah oh, damn it, yeah, there's no way around there. <laughs> Oh my days. Oh wow, he dodged it loads. You see him just shifted around. Oh my days, that was too close. Kerfuffle. I don't know how he didn't see them. Oh, I don't know if there's another person there. Right, hold on. I'm going to stand here for a second. See if I get spotted. I'm good. Hurry up. Come on. Alright, now we're headed 712 meters up that way. Alright, see if we can leave in the same way we came in. Stealthily. Where's your sniper at? Dude, there. They don't know. Okay, hold up. I've just had to come around. I just heard a big guy walking towards us. I have a feeling he's coming around this corner. Get those sons of bitches. He knows. HPT's off. He's out. Nice. Right. I'm gonna go. I'm. Fury scared me. Get those guns. Let's go. Let's I'm thinking, go. let's get this truck. Don't just take the truck. Away. Good God. We may have to hold off here for a second. I don't know what your face is. What? Alright, well. Here we go. It's gonna be fine. They were gonna hear us and see us driving away in this. I just wanted to try the new car. Or at least it looks like a new car. It's too far away. Shit, I'm not gonna go too He's far to from fire. my spot. Uh oh. About to fire on where? Us. Where? Oh, okay. I see him now. Excellent work. Thank you very much. Damn, that was intense. Took a lot of bullets to the leg. Uh oh. Oh my! Engage. How many more people, do you reckon? How many more people? Get rid of that. That actually makes it a little bit easier for us to see now. We've all got torches on. Should have done that a lot earlier. I'm thinking, I, I clearly, obviously, I didn't go loud on purpose, I'm not going to pretend I did, but I don't mind doing a little bit of stealth and a little bit of loudness, because this is just fun. I haven't played this in a while as well. Good to be back, to be honest. There's one guy on my right here, and there's one guy on my left, he's just behind there. Gotcha. Keep your focus, man! I'm pushing forward! Light those suckers up! Decent amount of people here. I don't want to shoot this tire. Come on, guy. Oh. We got more to deal with. Woof. Ah, 
How are you still alive, bro? I'm also scared about certain snipers in certain areas. Pretty sure we haven't eliminated all of them. This is not cool, man. I'm actually really scared. That's the truck! Uh oh. He's not. Unless there's some guy behind me. Oh. What? God damn. There's a lot of guys there, isn't there? Isn't there? Good lord. I think we've got to be alright now. I might go for a dash. Nope. Okay. Here we go. Get in the car, everybody. Can I take it? Yes. Hoo -hoo -hoo. That was a bit intense. Also, it's one of these bad boys, so anyone want to fight me? Because I'm ready. I don't think they want to fight me. Right, I'm just going to grab some quick ammo. Definitely used up a lot there, and I'm going to regret that. I don't pick this up. Alright, we're good. Let's go. That's a bad idea. That could be a sniper. I don't think it is. Alright, let's go. One of the tires is out. Not so good. Oh, there's my teammate on... No. I thought my teammate may have been on the turret, but they're not. Have any of my turret teammates can be there? No. I think one of them. Either way, it's fine. Alright, back to stealth, anyway. That was a lot of fun, but a bit too intense for my liking. I don't know, I had to get on the roof there, bro. Okay. Alright, what we got? We've got to interrogate somebody and we have to destroy four containers. Is that bright red thing one of the containers? I'm gonna guess so. Now we could do it really, really, really carefully. And uh, basically C4 all the containers. That could be a way to do it actually. And then just blow them all up at the end. That way we don't really have to take everybody out. The only thing that makes that tricky is I have to get in there and, and take out all the containers without anybody spotting me and that's probably asking too much of myself. <laughs> yes, I know. Will, always back yourself, but I don't know. I'm trying to be sensible here. I feel like that's a stupid shot to try and make. You know what? I'll go for the people, then we'll go for the explosions. I want to clear this place out. Now you're just showing off. I know, Careful. baby. I'm still looking, but uh. There you go, got him. So I can get his intel. Okay, let's go. There was another guy there. Got him. They're all on alert, you nonce rocket. Guess there was a second guy with him. I've already got my guy down that I need to interrogate, so that's fine. It's also nearly daytime already. Jeez. What's it looking like? Probably not a good idea. Some people over to the right. Definitely some people up ahead. I'm a little bit sweaty. Just making sure there's not any extra people. I, there's, there has to be more because I can hear them talking, but. Jeez. You want to? Okay, it's you. Sweet shot, ghost lead. Thanks, Mama. All right, let's interrogate this guy. It's probably a good time. Come here, 
Melissa. Oh, shit. God, that was so close. I think it was just there. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Right. Smack. Looking for your Russian CEO. Where is he? Oh, yeah. No need for violence. I'll tell you. No that guy's an violence? asshole. Worst boss I've had since I got here. You know, for all this shit, he's a lightweight. He keeps his ride gassed up so he can run at the first sign of trouble. Oh, was. Thanks for the intel, brother. Sorry you're not gonna make it to see the uh, fireworks and whatnot, right? There was a guy over this way. We still need to destroy the containers, but so far we're doing okay. If I could do this without being spotted, I'd be happy. Good gravy. That got intense. I know there was a guy over to my right. Is that a guy? Yeah. That's it. I shouldn't have run then. I started sprinting. My problems always come about from me sprinting. So maybe I should just stop. I think we're good. Now just for the containers? I think so. Alright, sweet. I actually did something well for once. Now let's finish this off nice and clean. Let's try and put one on each one. Have a big old explosion. Feel really good about ourselves. All day indeed. Last two. You know what? I actually didn't need to do the whole base because they're all on the outside. I should have just checked with my drone to start with. Ah oh, well, I got to show off that I know how to shoot people and kill them. I guess that's the most fun thing you'll ever see in your life. No, it's not. I don't know what I'm chatting about. Oh, well. All right. And... Hold up. I want to see them all. Boom! That was pretty sick. Very sick. I think I glitched the game, though. These uh, red areas aren't exactly leaving. Right, reach the Aurora Materials Deposit. 1.3k that way. Blew up the pickup truck, so I guess the only thing we can take is this slow ass thing. Okay! No need for that. In fact, you know what? No, no, no. I can't take that. It's absolutely horrendously slow. There should be a truck somewhere in this in this checkpoint. That's the stuff. I know. It was cool, wasn't it, love? Baby. God, I love playing stealthy. When I actually do it and I put my mind to it, it's all oh, I could have been killed by a train. I wouldn't have known that was coming. Uh oh. Thank you, sir. Don't crash into. Oh my, that could have been really bad. If you'd have crashed into that barrel, I'd have been sad. I'd have been dead. Nope. De my guy, get out. Get in the front. Thank you. Alright, mate. Alright. Let's go, team. Alright. Apparently, I'm here. Kind of drove up the mountain a little bit, so I wasn't just driving into the base. He's here somewhere. This should be interesting. I actually really like the build up to that. I'm not going to lie. I'll leave the. I'll go back to doing some oopsies if you don't know what the oopsies are. Basically, in all. Well, so most of the episodes that I've done of this game in the past. When I've tried to do something and I've died loads in the episode, I'll put the oopsies in at the end where I've failed loads. He's he's gonna drive. To the area. Boom, baby. <laughs> That's it. No need. No need. Oh, jeez, that was close. What? Engage. I literally just took cover in there. That's kind of annoying. It was only that drone that spotted me. Mate, I don't know why he was leaving. Oh. It is an absolute pleasure to finally speak, Nomad. Okay. Stone, how did you... We got civilians in the area. Be careful. All clear here. Well, rest assured, I can't locate you. Not yet. 
You've taken one of my pawns out of the game. Well done. Thank you. I'm impressed. Thank you. We're more alike than you think. Yeah. You are a butcher. Okay. Nothing more. Okay. Cursed to live in Walker's shadow. Okay. You don't see it yet, Nomad, but this is bigger than you. Ghosts won't change. We got an the enemy world. talker overhead. Oh, On me. Move it! And oh, Walker's oh. dead. <laughs> Thanks to you. I am. So what's that? Well, I kind of missed the end of that conversation because this geezer decided to come hey, after me, go. but. They're dead now. <laughs> Suckers. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm actually loving that he came out in his car. I feel like, yes, going into the base would have been fun. But you probably won't see that from somebody else's channel, right? You know what I mean? That's if anyone even plays this game anymore, if it's just me. I don't know. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave this episode here. That has been fun. A lot of fun. In fact, what did I get for doing that? Did it give me the, my, my items? Yep, it gave me a Bodak shirt. That's really nice. That's actually really nice. Like, really, really nice. I'll be wearing that in the next episode then. Everything I unlock, basically the customization clothes and stuff that I unlock from doing these missions, I will wear for the, for the next episode. Look at, oh, that looks so sick. Yes, mate. Oh. <laughs> Not quite sure what, what pants to wear and what gun to go with next time, but we'll make it match the, uh, the whole system. Don't you worry. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye. So far, so good. I know, there's people shouting. I get that. Okay. Or not. I don't actually realize how he spotted me then, but he did. It's going to be fine. I really didn't mean to mess this. Nope. Jeez, just God, wouldn't let me. Enemies can't go there, not the no go. It's gonna be fine. You got a kid. I know I do. Let's go. Going for the push. You they guys cover me. I'll get the chopper or something if there is a chopper, that is. <laughs> well, didn't mean for that to happen. Oh, that was close. Fucking hell, this is ridiculous. Two seconds, that got a little bit too... Oh. Fuck! Engaging. I'm hidden! I'm fucking hidden!